smart. Action! I love summer because kids don't have school. It's like free time. People run around. The weather's gorgeous. We can go swimming and just have like outside parties. What's not to like about summer? George, I'm talking to you. What? <gasps> Belinda, I'm in the weeds over here. George is a great guy. He's a family guy. He's a good husband, good father. Means well, but can never do anything right. What is going on here? Are you giving yourself a manicure? He's really the weakest link of the whole family. Dad, watch out! And everybody knows it. You mess with the bull, and you will get the banister horns. Belinda is the very competent wife of George, so I'm the one who is always fixing his messes. In Hollywood, marriages don't last long at all, and the marriage between me and Belinda has lasted six years so far, which is a lifetime in Hollywood. He is like my second husband. Sometimes I even call my husband, whose name is Charlie, George. She's really feeling like my real wife. And my real wife is Filipina, so I don't know how I get the two mixed up. This is Agent Bannister reporting to command. I've reached the objective. Ben is kind of, I guess you could call him a troublemaker. Ben! And he loves one thing, which is remote control helicopters. Let's go. Kara loves her family and um, loves Zeus, of course. That's me, Zeus. You know, like the Greek god. My character is uh, Zeus a former canine officer, very protective over his family, and sometimes uh, that gets him into a little trouble. I am throwing a baby shower with my new career as a party planner, and Zeus winds up destroying the party. You are in trouble, buddy. Ouch! Essentially, he goes to an obedience school because he's misbehaving. That's where they bring him to Vernon. Your canine does not know fear, do they? No, Vernon! Of course, we're working with Martin Cove, who is of Karate Kid fame. I'm a little bit scared because I think of that character <laughs> and it scares me. He was so mean. Vernon runs a very tight ship. Now jump! Yes, sir! <laughs> and believes himself to be Patton, General George Patton. Well, he's not that much different from John Kreese. He is John Kreese. He really is John Kreese. If you get a chance to finish him off, sweep the paw. Zeus is also picked on by a rival dog named Apollo, played by Billy Zapka. You're in my world now, canine. You better get used to doing things my way. Apollo's giving him a real hard time, so Zeus finds his Miyagi in Mr. Lee. I know what you're thinking. Come on, let's go. He comes to me in need of help. He doesn't admit it, but I tell him, I can do something for him. I'll teach you in exchange. You be my assistant. You bet, Mr. Lee. I won't let you down. He wants to learn. Plant Paul. And he learns through these exercises I give him. Physically and spiritually, he breaks the mold of his old self. Sooner or later, we're in a competition, and he leaves the competition in order to um, take down the, uh, the villains. Ah, yes, working with Joey Coco Diaz and Patrick Muldoon again. The bumbling crooks are at it once again. We're like a family, an idiot family. There's no way that phone will make it through the scene. Orange may be the new black, but I don't like wearing this orange. I don't like being in jail. Eddie wants to get out of jail, so uh, he needs a little help from his buddies. So they devise some interesting ways to get Ted out. Some might be effective. You're the best, Fred. Some not so effective. Two words, boys. Prince of Valley, jewelers. We are going to steal this massive diamond. And Zeus gets in our way again. <coughs> Zeus Bannister. That silly, silly dog is our foil. Always stops us somehow, but not this time. I love working on family films, especially because now I have a daughter, and so I'm actually doing films that she can watch. It's the only time that I get to do comedy. You get to do pratfalls, you get to do physical stuff, you get to make jokes. Everyone's always happy. I mean, we all get together and we all get along. It's awesome. It's just a great atmosphere. They feel good. They, uh, they're entertaining, it's light, uh, it's, a, it's a lot of fun for me. For all your dog lovers, you'll love this film. It's a great movie for kids and parents to watch together. It's good, clean, family fun.